Hello and welcome everyone. Uh, thank you very much for joining me on this video. It's been a while since I've posted a uh, video here on YouTube. I hope everyone is uh, keeping well at the moment and I thought I'd do a video on this particular one here that we're gonna, I'll open up for you shortly. Um, I hope everyone's doing doing fine over these, uh, over these crazy times that we're living in at the moment. And uh, to my viewers in America, I hope all is well. I'm watching um, you guys with uh, a lot of interest in relation to uh, post-election, um, how things are going to happen, what is happening there. And, you know, I don't want to post my political views on the situation, but um, it's going to be very interesting. And uh, I hope uh, truth prevails in the end in relation to the, the crazy things that are happening there. But, um, yeah, let's talk about the 007. Um, there were three in this set. This is the second one. You can see there it's hashtag two. This is the pay attention 007. And... Uh, I won this on auction actually. I I didn't uh, I didn't take much particular interest in this uh, in this particular one, but um, I thought it was up for a good price. I thought I'd have a go. Won it on auction. I thought, well, you know, just add it to uh, add it to my collection. So this is the proof um, one ounce, and it's released by the Royal Mint. Uh, their packaging is always exceptional. Um, so we're going to take a look. It's obviously it's got it's meant to look like a brushed. Um, brush steel effect you can see the lines run across there with 007 tm um so let's have a look at the pay attention 007 everyone so obviously it comes in you've got the traditional uh case that the coin comes in that's right the other way around with the embossed royal mint logo and then on also they have this um booklet with it and um the first one featured the db5 i believe it was um the Aston Mark DB and this one features the Lotus which was in the um, Roger Moore um, run of uh, 007 movies so let's have a look and see what we got here so got a very nice uh, booklet um, I had a look at this already it's the Pierce Brosnan and James Bond uh, Tomorrow Never Dies uh, it's the first one you see actually on there which is interesting because this one features the Lotus you think they would have had the Lotus there <laughs> initially uh, for those that aren't, aren't familiar with the Lotus, the Lotus was the 007 car that uh, was able to turn itself into a submarine. Um, but um, obviously this is some of the technology. This is Sean Connery. Um, bless him. Um, he passed away actually fairly recently, for those that uh, are unaware of it. The first uh, James Bond character to, to pass away, or actor that portrayed the... Uh, uh, betrayed James Bond. There's the Lotus there, as we can see the iconic, uh, the spy who loved me. There it is. There, uh, Bond's car attacked as he uh, drives into the sea, and um, some more images there. Rather oh, nice quality booklet with these in the tail. There's the submarine car and the spy who loved me. I'm going to take a look at the coin. I'm sure you're all excited. There's that's what the uh, the coin looks like. Um, so we can see it there. We're going to have a look and see what the proof. Um, can show us so there we go embossed royal mint logo the boxes are very nice indeed um, I've actually ordered the Elton John five ounce proof so I'm hoping to get my hands on that and I'll probably do a video for you guys if you want me let me know in the comments below do you want me to do um, a video on that one but um, there it is the smashing 007 pay attention sorry 007 pay attention sorry you can see the double o in the background but uh pay attention 007 with the lotus there and i must say the the detail on this is exceptional and we're going to have a closer look there and you can see the bubbles actually see those little whites it almost looks like probably milk spots everyone's probably probably saying at this stage but uh those are actually bubbles um from the uh the submarine or the lotus as it's underwater and um I don't know. For those that have, that have seen these, the two ounce version has actually got micro engraving on the number. So uh, the zero and the seven on the two ounce piece has got all the titles of all the James Bond movies in. Um, but again, really nice. The mirror feels there, just exceptional. You can see that nice reflection there. Let's flip it round and we can see there all uh, Queen Elizabeth II on the back there. Mirror feels just superb. I did have a close look at this one. Uh, I can't see any imperfections that I, that I can see. I'm not going to send this in for grading. It's just going to end up in its box and remain that way. Uh, I, I I don't think the values on these are particularly uh, high enough to warrant that, but uh, you never know. Some of the 007 graded coins are, are still worth a bit of cash, but um, that is just superb. 
uh, pay attention 007 uh, very nice indeed and uh, reeded edge on the side the capsules on that are really nice on these they sort of twist you just turn it and it comes off rather a nice bit of detail but uh, let's have a look at the coa now the box on these don't flip up like the sovereigns like you, you notice in a lot of the gold sovereigns they sort of flip up and uh, this whole piece um turns up which is rather a nice touch but not on this one anyway so um uh, let's have a look at the coa and see what kind of plane really not much no, 4126 i think there was uh 7,000, or 7,007 in presentation. That's down here. You got Jody Clark, uh, proof quality. It says they're maximum coin vintage, which means that there's probably going to be sets that will probably have these in uh, as well. And I think you can get, uh, you can buy all three coins in, in sort of one set with a uh, with a capsule. And obviously a bit of history there in relation to the uh, Royal Mint uh, hologram logo on the back. Rather a nice piece. Really nice quality. I don't think you can really go wrong with something like this uh, for those that are interested in this sort of thing. But um, thanks for watching as always. Um, I don't know when I'll make another video, but um, let me know in the comments below if you guys want me to make some videos. Again, it's, it all depends on what interesting stuff I get for you guys. So as much as I'll be making videos, <laughs> i got to have the right kind of coins. But um, let me know what you think of this. Is, is it something you'd, uh, you'd look at? Um, is it something that you've got you haven't looked at? But, um, yeah, let me know. Guys, thanks for watching. It's good to be on. Um, hope everyone's keeping well. And, uh, guys, stay safe. And uh, take care. See you on the next one.